Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, oh, let me move this. So instead of another episode of Try Hack Me, I'm going to show you guys uh, how I pass my CompTII uh, certifications. As you can see, my first one is CompTII Plus, and I finish around August and, it, and September. So pretty much it's a two part test. One is, uh, I believe is hardware and the second part is more software based. Um, why I did prep was to be honest, I did have a strong interest in computers when I was in high school. I used to build computers for fun and uh, I play a lot of video games. So it took me this long to finally realize that this is like my uh, passion and interest. And I told myself if I pass the first test, I will keep going. And if I didn't pass the first IT certification, I would just stop there and, uh, you know, uh, just be continuing on my current uh, career path. But I passed the first A plus test. I got a little bit uh, confidence and cocky. And I didn't study as much on the second part. Then I failed the first, the second part. Then I restudy again. And uh, for the total length of time of A plus, the first and the second part was about two months. So a month, uh, f a month for the first part and the, uh, another month for the second part. Now, to let you know, guys, to pass these IT certification exam, you must have, you know, a, I guess a strong interest or a passion in IT. Um, it's not just about having a good career, but for me personally, this is something that I finally found something that I like to learn and that I'm not distracted. In the past, I'm not a classroom type of person, just like learning. And I thought that that was not my style. It's just that other subjects, I just had, didn't have a strong interest. And these IT exams, studying, uh, I, uh, as you can see, I got five certification and this is just by studying with my own time and money. So this is something I like to do. So anyways, guys, uh, so this is how I pass my comp TII A plus exam. Uh, first thing is this is my work. Hold on, let's see. So my work has skill solved database system. And wait, let's see, there you go. And I pretty much went through let's see, it's loading. So I pretty much went through all the videos and learning curve. Still loading. It's not that fast. So last year I took the CompTIA IA plus 2020-1001 and 1002. So obviously currently it's the 2011-02. So they update every three years or so. And yeah, I completed uh, all these videos. So that was the first part. That and every day you should learn a little bit by chunks. So you have you should have small goals to lead a bigger goal. So you should have I don't know, cut a chunk of time, an hour, thirty minutes every day, whatever you can do and uh, pick at it. So my first part is my uh, work skill self database system. Uh, I finish all, all that. My second part is my smartphone. Uh, I had the comp TI A plus practice exam. So it's basically an app, just a bunch of exams. Uh, every day, just answer 10, 20 questions. 
and we remind ourselves. So it's from ABC e learning. So I obviously have the 20, 22 version. So smartphone, my work, uh, learning platform, then also, uh, Udemy. So I use Udemy for the second part, as you can see, uh, test prep exam. And I pretty much, again, more just exam questions. And uh, the core of the certification is you have to know the fundamentals and what the question is asking about. So Udemy from Jason Dion is basically showing you how to answer questions in the CompTI format, but also understand uh, what the questions means. And you have to learn the learning objectives. You can't just memorize the answers. Um, and that's the three parts. And the last part is you can use um, you can use exam dumps as part of your learning strategy, but I would not recommend memorizing the answers because you will get into a rabbit hole and uh, sometimes it's not uh, best for long term. So understand the, the learning objectives and find ways to save money. For example, Udemy courses, I only buy ones on sale. Like for example, right now it's $84.99, but when it's on sale, it will be $11.99, $12.99. Um, since I work in the government sector, when I did my CompTIA A+, uh, testing, uh, for the both parts, it was less than, during that time it was less than $350. So, uh, total spent for both part tests, A plus, um, less than $400 total. And this works for me because this is my interest in learning. And I have, uh, I guess you say habits of just self-motivation and uh, completing these, um, learning objectives. So, yeah, so that's my my way of passing CompTI uh, certification tests was my work database. Uh, they have uh, videos of learning. Then I use my smartphone app, CompTI A plus practice test from ABC Learning. Then I use Udemy from JC and uh, Dion. You can buy the, the course uh, and test prep exam and simulations. And obviously uh, you can use exam tones, but that's my labs option. And to save money is buy on sale whenever Udemy's on sale. And I'm in the government sector, but you can use whatever percentage off they have these, they're always on sale. Anyway, you guys, I hope this video is helpful. Uh, I will show you how I pass uh, these rest of the exam network plus pen tests and um, they're all about the same but different variations so but if you like this video guys please leave a thumbs up hit the subscribe button hit the notification button i'm trying to pump videos out uh at least twice a week uh sometime work gets in the way and uh yeah uh you and uh thanks for watching guys till the next video so